Hello everyone, Gucci for the win here, and welcome back to Pokemon Let's Go Eevee. I believe in the last episode I said I would start off with a team recap, but I don't remember. But here we are anyways. So first off, we got our nice little Adamant Ivasaur. Heck yeah. Level 17 with Tackle, Poison Powder, Vine Whip, and Leech Seed. Um, next, we have our level 17 Pidgey. Uh, soon to be Pidgeotto, I hope. Rockin' uh, Tackle, Roost, Wing Attack, and Quick Attack. Then we have Eevee, the namesake of the game, with Headbutt, Double Kick, Bite, Quick Attack, level 17. We have a level 14 Pikachu with Thundershot, Growl, Tail Whip, Quick Attack, which is 7 or 8 levels away from Thunderbolt. We have a new edition of Charmander, level 13, with Scratch, Growl, Smoke Screen, and Ember. And then our last one, bringing up the rear is going to be Psyduck, level 13, Scratch Tail Whip, and Water Gut, just so we can have a little bit of Water Stab. Uh, so I <clears throat> I don't remember what town we're in. It's been a while since I've played. Is this Vermilion? Cerulean. Okay. Uh, so I think I know where I'm trying to go at the very least. Um, maybe. <laughs> I believe I'm trying to go up. Oh wait. Uh interesting. Huh. Um Officer Jenny, I don't want to uh Don't want to ruin your parade here, but uh, the thief is still behind the house. He's right there. He's right there. You're useless, Officer Jenny. You're completely garbage. What is your problem? Oh, well. Officer Jenny is useless. <laughs> that is... Uh, wait, do we have, do I, ha, wait, what? Okay, in the old games, you could see, like, a trainer card. Oh, uh, oh, we've not, we've not taken on this gym, so that's why we're here. Oh, well, here we go. We figured it out. We don't have cut yet. <laughs> I think I'm getting my other playthrough mixed up with this one. Nice little decorations throughout this gym here. Uh, excuse me, I got, I just got home from work. I'm trying to pound this out before, uh, before we move on, or before I have stuff to do later. So I'm trying to pound this video out real quick so I can have it ready to go and upload it on Tuesday, which, barring any technical difficulties, should happen. You should be seeing this on Tuesday. But we're leading with our Ivasaur, which will be very beneficial. Hopefully, my m, &M crunching is not showing up through the microphone. I really do apologize if it is. I, I won't eat any more m ms while I record this episode, I promise. Alright, so this chump should go down to a Vine Whip. An adamant Vine Whip. No problem. Okay. That's fine. We're getting the, uh, the RNG in our favor for today. That's good. That's what I like to see. I need that good luck. I gotta go play a softball game later. That's what. That's why I'm trying to make sure I get through this real quick. Let's so all be ready to play for that. I really should have Pikachu out front, probably. That's what I should be doing, but I'm not doing it. So, here we are. <laughs> Shelter. Um, I'll switch Pikachu to front after this, uh, just so I can make sure <clears throat> he gets a little bit more experience. I know experience seems to be pretty shared, but I feel like the, the Pokemon who participate in battle get a little more experience. Um, I could be totally wrong. That could absolutely be not a thing, but just in case it is, I'm going to make sure. Alright. 
97. Actually, we can we can we can verify. <laughs> we will see how much. All right, so uh, we're gonna move you to the front. All right, let's check the experience. Okay. Points needed to level up, 573. So current number is 3225. Okay. Uh, 3225. We'll remember that number. 3225. 3225. 3225. 3225. 3225. 3225. She did die very well. So she probably deserves that gold medal she just mentioned. Seal. I like how doofy Seal looks. He's just got his tongue sticking out between his fangs. Like, blah, 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 blah. It's funny. All right, you're gonna eat this really pitiful thunder shock fairly well, I'm sure. Oh gosh, it's like a four-hit KO. No stab, but it's going to be a three-hit KO. Maybe we could paralyze you off of one of these. Oh, Aqua Jet. Oh no, he's got priority. Oh, that's a five-hit KO. Ugh, this is not good. All right, Ivysaur, I figured I'd have to bring you out. But it's good that Pikachu got to got to play play around a little, you know. It's it's good. All right. And at this range a vine whip uh, from this Ivysaur I would hope could take out this seal. There we go. That's what I like to see. Thank you. Okay, 103. Oh, 86. See, there's there's inequality here. Okay, so we're going to see how much Pidgey gained. Because this is how you learn. Okay, so how much did Pidgey gain? He had 32.25. And now he has 32.77. So he only got 52 experience points. So I am correct. There is some experience share inequalities here <clears throat> all right well we're gonna heal up before we take on misty by the way spoiler alert the gym leader in this town is misty oh there's a dude with a whip what's he doing you know it's 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 really nice to appreciate like the the scale and everything of all the Pokemon that show up in this game. It's really nice to be able to appreciate that for once because I haven't been able to until now. Uh, what? Bounce? What is this? What is this move? It's a water move. Uh, user attacks by shooting water bubbles at the target, then absorbs water and restores its HP by half. Oh wow. Uh so that's like a water giga drain almost. That's crazy. Uh what what other moves does this dude have? Buzzy Buzz and Sizzly Slide. Is this electric? It is electric. Shoots a jolt of electricity to attack the target, also leaves the target with paralysis. That almost sounds like it's a guaranteed paralysis. That's pretty crazy. I never knew this dude was here. And this is going to be fire. <laughs> so this makes me think you can evolve EV eventually. User cloaks itself in fire and charges at the target. Leaves the target with a burn. <laughs> that is actually probably a really good attack to have. I think it was physical too, which is actually good uh, to be able to give Flareon a physical fire attack because I think I think that's the biggest issue with Flareon is he's he's got all those attack points and no moves to use them with uh, the, the way um, the way the game had attacks set up when like in the original blue and red is um, whether or not it was a special or physical attack was based on uh, the moves type so like fire was physical psychic was special uh, and that's how they would calculate all those things. So, if there's a fire Pokemon, 
or really there's there's could be plenty of other types but if there's a pokemon that seems like it should have it it has a better special move pool but better attack points that is more than likely the reason why <clears throat> all right here's the real issue with going against um misty right here because psyduck is her first pokemon right her other pokemon is going to be a starmie which is stupid fast uh along with being part psychic so i don't know how well ivasaur is going to handle said starmie but we will find out and I'm not sure if I want to bring, if I want to switch Ivasaur in. I, I guess I have to, essentially, if I want Pikachu to gain some extra experience. My question is, why does Ivasaur get more experience than Pikachu? Is it because it actually got the knockout? That's that's something I would, I would like to know. <laughs> All right, here we go. Bring your Pikachu back out. Uh, kind of switch training. <clears throat> Might also have to do with just the amount of work. Well, if that was the case, then Pikachu would have gotten more there because he took him down um, below half. So I don't know. I just play the game, and whatever happens, happens. Oh, please don't burn. Okay, that's good. That would have been scary. Oh no! Here comes that psychic move. Okay. Alright, so we got another... We can take another side wave because th that's... Oh, he's gonna use Swift. Alright, we're gonna bring out a potion here. Um... I don't have any super potions. I'm bad at this game. Oh boy, we might just have to bring Eevee in. Cause that'll take... No, it didn't. Wait, what? I'm confused. Well, there goes Ivasaur. <laughs> I don't even know what I hit. Obviously wasn't healing. Alright, Eevee. Let's get you some work in here. Uh, we'll get you a bite to go off. So he goes from 58 to 45. What what determines the power of Psywave? I don't know. I'm so confused. I thought it was like Seismic Toss and like it did, or and Nightshade, and it did the amount that the level was. But I guess it's just a move that does not check for weakness or resistance and just gives you a blanket amount of uh, damage. Alright. And we got Scald from Misty, so that'll be good. Uh, we can actually go ahead and put that on Psyduck. Give him a little bit better of a move pool here. That would be really good for him. Or her, sorry. We actually have a lady on the squad for once. What's up with that? Alright. So we're going to go back to the Pokemon Center and the useless nurse. Or not nur nurse. Uh, nurse Joy is actually useful. Although she is very... Um, I don't know what a word for this would be. She she wishes us to come back to the Pokemon Center, which the building's primary function is to heal, like, hurt Pokemon. So she's basically wanting our Pokemon to be hurt enough to come again. See? We hope to see you again. She hopes that our Pokemon are in dire need of medical assistance so that we will come back. It's a little ominous, if you ask me. Uh, did we do... Uh, did... No, we did not do the Nugget Bridge. Oh. Whoops. 
Yeah, we were supposed... Okay, well, we jumped ahead a little bit. That's okay. We'll, we'll probably be able to fight Roman here and then just call it a day. And then we can do Nugget Bridge in the next episode and go visit Bill. Um, yeah, because look at the level difference. We're supposed to, like, do the, build, the whole Bill shenanigans first, for sure. That's okay. Pikachu gets some good experience here. Uh, Pidgey didn't use Quick Attack. Even better. Save some HP. Works for me. <clears throat> Level 15. Um, he's going to want to learn Double Kick here soon if he hasn't already. There's Thunder Wave. I would definitely take a Thunder Wave. I'm sure that'll maybe possibly come in handy. That's always like a staple in any Pikachu I have. It's like a staple in that Pikachu's move pool. Um, and fortunately, we actually have a fire type that needs leveled up to take on this Oddish that's about to come and hit the field. Charmander with his flaming butt. All right. Singe that thing all the bits. Uh, don't do a lot of damage, please. Okay, it's only 10. Okay. So we should be able to kill you before you kill us. Especially since we outspeed. If we get a burn, that'd be awesome. Poison powder, that's even uh, less troubling than using an actual damaging move. Especially when it only takes 4 damage from us. Aww. Oh. That was rude. It'd be nice if we get get a burn. No. I was hoping I could speak it into existence. That's okay. Uh, this should take out the Oddish right here, hopefully. There we go. We're good to go. See? All good. No problemo. No problemo. And we get Charmander to level up as well, which is even better. Just keep on growing them, you know? That's what my mama always said. Not really. But you could imagine. Uh, Ivasaur got treated a little uh, unfairly in Misty's gym. Not really. I just didn't have any super potions. I thought it was a lot further <laughs> along in the game than I actually am. And that's, that's my bad. I'm mixing up my playthroughs here. Uh, but... We will try to... Oh, no! We'll never hit a Poison Powder now. Told you. Well, uh, can we at least Leech Seed you? Please do not do this. I do not need this in my life right now. Oh, brother. We're probably just going to have to start Vine Whipping. Yep, we're going to have to crack the whip. I can't just stand around and let you take advantage of me like this. Oh, wow. <laughs> Almost one shot with a vine whip. Uh, we'll see if a tackle will take you out. Oh, I probably would if you would just hit it. Oh, brother. Why is this a thing? Thank you, Ivasaur. Thank you, Ivasaur. Beautiful. That's what I like to see. And he gets the level up that he was so abruptly denied in Misty's gym. Hey. You know, even for going out of order, we still managed to make it. So. There's a Pokemon that's talking. Oh my, we're going to grab this item real quick because I see it every time I walk by. Uh, never mind. You don't have access to the garden. Sorry for barging in. Not really. Alright. Let us proceed to the backyard. The man's not even looking. Wow, 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 wow. 
Rare candy. I think that used to be a hidden item, actually. <laughs> Back in the day. Yeah, there's nothing hidden in here anymore. Alright. So, we'll just go heal up at the Pokemon Center. And then in the next episode, we will go on and take, uh, take Nugget Bridge. Uh, and by take it, I mean we will actually uh, try to take it on. Uh, should be the term I'm using there, but instead I guess I'm going to conquer it. But we're going to heal up. Um, sorry for going out of order. Uh, I, don't, I mean, it doesn't matter that much, but when it comes to being over or under leveled for things, uh, like we're going to be over leveled for Nugget Bridge, it it might matter to some people but thank you guys so much for watching make sure you subscribe so you don't miss the next episode of let's go eevee and i will see you guys next time peace out